I'm still kind of heartbroken after the last episode and the old lady and her daughter and this, that whole situation. I can't lie. But the other, like the devil, you have like the angel and the devil. You know, the angel's like, oh, but that lady. And the devil's like, but Thorfinn's fucking shit up. And so I'm like, I don't know, you know. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius, back at it again with another episode of Vinland Saga, episode 7. Last episode, we had Thorfinn growing up with Askeladd, um, gaining a lot more knowledge and skills when it comes to killing and being a pirate, being a viking, a thug, you know? The whole him being taken in by that nice, I, for, I forget their names, I don't think I had them written down, by that nice lady whose son died and, their, and then uh, her daughter, and it's just like, and then Thorfinn trying to warn them to run, and then going away and then making the signal and Askeladd coming and killing everybody and it's like I, I, I guess she died I have no idea I thought she got away she just but I mean with how distraught she looks on her face and the comb being broken she easily could have died in the chaos I have no idea it's just a tragic situation all in all but I am still hyped to get this next episode so I'm not gonna waste any more time I'm just gonna throw my plugs out there and we're gonna hop into this so remember if you guys like the episode and like the format I'm doing right here but want to see the entire thing down here or the next one when you're done you can always check out the patreon down below uh, if you guys want to ask me any questions or chat with any members of the dapper squad check out the discord also down below hop in there guys it's a fun community I'm not joking also follow me on twitch I'm gonna be streaming a lot more so follow me on twitch let's hop into this villain saga episode 7 October. Okay. That's Floki. You can tell by that voice. They next summer. Okay, so we're taking a break for the winter. And is that the leader of the Yams Vikings, aka that's Sigvaldi, right? If I remember correctly, that Thor said. Kingdom of France, lawyer, law, lawyer, river. Oh my God, that is a huge. What do you call those? A ram. Nice simple word for it. Oh my God, there'd be so much force with it. You've got to get the momentum in it. They're holding it by ropes, you know? Sheesh. Crossbows are nuts. Frankenstein's <laughs> Doesn't it smell? Man, can you imagine living this kind of life? So you literally see something, you want it, you actually don't give a fuck, you take it with your boys. I, can, I honestly cannot imagine in this day and age someone living like this. That'd be crazy, you know? The boonies. You always send Thorfinn on the scouting missions with the double fucking daggers. Ooh. Oh, that's so clean to have one in front, one in back. Okay, man. He is full blown like a young adult. He looks like, what, 16, 17 right there at least. He could be 18, 19. <laughs> Going to the leaders of the attackers. I thought he was going to the leaders of the four guys. Makes sense. Same kind of mission infiltrate, make a signal, come and raid. He wants his duel now. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you, Askeladd. Come on. He's such a trickster. One head with a helmet. Yeah, get this one done, and then you could do it. Even that Naruto run, maybe. So it's a win-win. 
戦利品の半分をよこせだと傭兵不正が銭に乗りよって戦利品の半分をよこせだと断るかこの話ならばアシラットの兵100人は砦側と手を結ぶ,手を結ぶ俺が死んだ場合も同じだ商談成立の合図がない場合北海の猛者100人がお前の敵になる That's facts. He's, he's, not, he's not saying anything wrong. He's not doing this for intimidation. He's just saying what the next couple of steps are going to be. One higher arrow and two low arrows. Let's hurry. So I want to know are we actually going to do like our job? Like, are we being mercenaries right now or are we being pirates? I guess I'll find out. さまの仲間、コヌではないか。わしも生きて見てみたいもんだ。もう日が昇ってしまったぞ。もう日が昇ってしまった。いいから突撃しろ、テーブ。すぐにわかる。ああ、なんか悪口言っただろ。どうやら
Nope, he's right there with the head of the man, not only the leader, but somebody you might have mentioned, you know, just the head and the helmet. We got it. The official dual call out. At least take a little breather first. You're all soaking wet, you know, dry off, you get a bite to eat, you know. He's in a shiny treasure, let him take it off, you know. Ask me again. <laughs> but all the arrows come raining in. Are they just gonna go straight down the waterfall? What about all the treasure? They just don't give a flying fuck. Must have lost a couple of coins up in there. These are some wild ass men. He's been stalling that little boy's duel for so long. I guess I can't call him a little boy anymore, but it's been that long. So I, I'm really liking these little closed little mini arcs. I wouldn't even call it really an arc. I mean, it is because an arc is technically just start, climax, you know, resolution, downside. But uh, I'm really liking it. Like we got introduced to the situation and where Sigvaldi, I'm guessing, because he's even in the intro, he's shrouded a lot in this mystery. Loki's, you know, looking up to him as a boss. So I'm guessing Sigvaldi's saying, we're going to let our guys rest for the winter. We'll attack next summer. And so the mercenaries who are being hired to fight, we're like, we're out of a job. What are we going to do? They see this opportunity where these the, the Franks are attacking other Franks. Um, and they the whole send... Uh, Send Thorfinn to scout and to do the, be the messenger thing. He's done that a couple of times, but it's really smart. Like Thorfinn's really, even though he's bad at doing it, he's really good at doing it. If that makes any sense, some of you don't know what I mean, but you know what I'm saying. So that works out. Meanwhile, he's like, I'm so sick of you stalling, fucking Askeladd. Just fucking duel me right now. He's like, bring, cut, you know, cut off. Bring me a head and a helmet. We'll talk. So that's that's his main goal. That's Thorfinn's main goal. He sees the head and the helmet. The, the captain does that, executes him so cleanly with the sword and the daggers in the mouth. I love how when he got captured by fat fat ass, the first the, the last thing that he really emphasized was like, "Give me back my dagger, no matter what." It's a prize memento for my father. Goddamn, Thor's is a beautiful man. I miss his soul. But it seemed more of a seemed definitely like a continuation on last episode finishing off the growing montage because his voice is deep as fuck now the growing montage of thorfinn but also setting us up to a point to where our guys are just out there roaming doing their own kind of shit not necessarily warfare right now but i am i have no idea where it's gonna go i we could honestly have a time cut next episode right summer where they're about to start attacking i have no idea you know that's just what's that's just what's gonna go down I am very excited though. I think I actually am just going to watch this next episode right now, you know? Um, so if you guys want to see that next episode right now, you can always check out the Patreon down below. If you guys want to see the entire thing, you can always check out the Patreon. I don't think I have any questions right now in the Q&A, but you guys can always check out the Discord if you guys want to ask me any questions or talk to any members of the Dapper Squad. I do not. Um, also, make sure you follow Twitch. Like I said, game's coming up. Thank you so much, Dapper Squad. Peace out, you guys. I'll see you next episode.